Hey everyone, how are you doing? Welcome to the PDF Element channel. I'm Jens from the Wondershare PDF Element team and I'm here for your assistance. No matter if you're a business or an individual, there will come a point in life where you have to fill out, sign or prepare contracts or forms in some kind of way. And when this point in life comes, it would be great to be prepared for all kinds of situations coming your way. Today I would like to present to you PDF Elements professional form editing features that will provide you with the most important and also essential tools to manage all things business. Let's get started. If you are looking for an affordable PDF editor that allows you to fill out forms on Windows, Mac and mobile devices, then PDF Element Pro is definitely the right choice for you. First, open up the fillable PDF document of your choice on the home screen. Once opened, we can immediately see a notification popping up in the top left corner telling us that our PDF document includes interactive form fields. Those interactive fields will be highlighted in blue by default. If that is not to your liking, feel free to turn this option off. Next, simply click on the field you want to fill in and start typing. It's as easy as this. Some boxes will require you to choose between listed options, check boxes or pick from a drop down menu. All of those actions can be executed with a few simple clicks. This time suppose you are the party in charge of creating a form or contract of some sort that needs to be filled out. Not only does PDF Element help you fill out forms, it actually helps you create your own fillable documents within a few simple steps. First. Open a blank PDF document or an already prepared one that needs interactive form fields. From the menu bar select the form option and proceed by clicking form edit. In the top menu you will now be able to use a variety of form editing features that will allow you to create your desired fillable PDF document. Let's say you want to add a name field. Click on the T symbol and place it at its desired position. You can also add rectangular or round checkboxes if you wish. Another option would be to add a drop down list. Navigate your mouse towards the combo box and drag and drop it at the position of your choice. Next, open up the combo properties window, go to the options and add the items that you want to appear in the drop down list. Last but not least, you will be able to add signature fields to your documents in case that another party needs to sign your form. We just now introduced signature fields, so why not try them out, shall we? Go to the interactive signature field of your document and left click on it. If you have not yet created an ID, click on the new ID button and proceed by following the instructions. After you're done, click on sign and that's it. The same option is available if you click on protect in the menu bar and just sign everything using the available options. Another way to sign a document is by navigating towards the comments section and by picking the custom stamp option. Upload for example your business stamp and lastly proceed by adding your stamp at the desired position. Sometimes you receive tabular forms that include a lot of information. For example if you conducted a survey and would now like to extract all the data from those scanned documents. PDF Element can recognize these tabular forms and can extract all the necessary information from it. Open up the document of your choice and navigate towards the form section. Now simply click on data extraction and follow the instructions by picking the format of your choice. If you've scanned the PDF file, check the marked PDF field and proceed by highlighting the areas you want PDF element to recognize. After that's done, save your new settings and then click yes. Now a new window pops up that will allow you to choose identical form files that you want to extract data from. Drag and drop them into the window and click start to begin the extraction process into a single CSV file. By pressing the finish button the excel sheet will open up in a new window and that's it. If this video was to your liking make sure to give this video a like and to leave some feedbacks down there in the comments below. Also, if you would like to know about more features and future updates coming to PDF Element Pro, make sure to subscribe to this channel. All the relevant links can be found down there at the top of the description as well as a free trial to PDF Element Pro, so make sure to check that out. This has been Jens from the Wondershare PDF Element team and I'm seeing you in the next video. Ciao!